What's up? Pastor Baller here. This is now the 10th game or the 10th prediction for this January 28, 2022 NBA game day. This will be New York Knicks with the record of 23 wins and 26 losses, visiting Milwaukee Bucks with the record of 30 wins and 20 losses. This one will be played 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. That's going to be 11 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. And again, I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pase Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on the bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. All right, let's take a look at the Eastern Conference standing so that we would see as to how these two teams are doing. Uh, Milwaukee Bucks, they are at number 6 in the East. For their last 10 games, they have won 5. That's pretty decent. But approaching this game, they're coming off a loss. Now for New, for New York Knicks, they are uh, down there at number 11. For their last 10 games, they have only won 4. And approaching this game, they're coming off back-to-back -back losses. Alright, so on this game, Milwaukee Bucks would be enjoying the home court advantage. In terms of momentum, we got to give it a pass. You know, uh, both teams are coming off losses, um, and both teams are actually coming off rest days. So we can just uh, skip that, um, that fatigue factor talk. For New York Knicks, I'm looking at the uh, injury list now. Uh, I see Derrick Rose is still out, um, while Noel and RC Diacono are both tagged as uh, questionable for. Uh, New York. So Derek Rose out um, one out for New York, possibly three, depending on uh, the situations of those two. Now for their opponent, Milwaukee Bucks. Um, Brooke Lopez is still, still out. Wigginton still out. While Allen um, is on game time decision. Wesley Matthews is tagged as probable. And Rodney Hood uh, tag us doubtful. So again, two confirmed out, Lopez and Wigginton. Now Allen, Matthews, and Hood. Uh, let's just uh, keep an eye on any updates for those three. The spread is minus nine for the home team, Milwaukee Bucks. Now this one sucks because everybody knows that I'm a New York Knicks fan and I'm a New York Knicks fan. Um, but I, I gotta give it, you know, I gotta give it to Milwaukee Bucks. Um, I'm looking at Milwaukee Bucks getting the W on this. Um, uh, for, you know, for some strange reason, uh, New York Knicks can't find a way to end the game right. You know, they're able to come back, they're able to grab the lead, but towards the end, you know, they're, they're actually losing it. Um, so I think Milwaukee Bucks will actually have the win, but if we can hold up a bit, uh, the spread of minus nine, I guess it's a bit, a bit big i mean considering uh considering the fact that milwaukee bucks also got some you know some players who are out and considering the fact that uh the new york knicks uh would have mitchell robinson back so uh they have you know they have big buddies there um i think it's gonna be milwaukee bucks having the w but i'm gonna side with the new york knicks because that plus nine is actually so tempting so i think again milwaukee bucks would win but the new york knicks should be able to cover that plus nine um i think uh i think barrett um and reddish uh it's 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 due for those two to actually show what they can do whenever they ball together so again my pick would be new york knicks plus nine knicks plus nine peace out pass love and god bless